You mentioned that you're about 24 weeks along. You had an early ultrasound when you were six weeks. We weren't sure when your last period was, and that's probably the reason why the doctor did an ultrasound because there's two ways to figure out how far along a woman is. One is going off her previous cycle history. If a woman has had a history of regular periods, um, then they'll ask you what your last period date was. And if you're sure about it, then it's pretty easy to figure out how far along you are. But if a woman has irregular periods or you don't know when your period was, then an ultrasound is the best way to date your pregnancy. A fetus will grow at a pretty consistent rate during the first trimester. And so when they did the ultrasound at six weeks and figured that your baby was six weeks along, that's the best and most accurate thing that we can go by. Um, in fact, if a baby starts to be either larger or smaller than they should be in the second or third trimester, a lot of times we ask, did she have an early ultrasound? Because that's the best way to figure out if our due dates are accurate. So because your due date was based on an early ultrasound, you can say that it's really accurate, as accurate as we can get. So you also had some questions about the, the extra weeks added on at the beginning of a pregnancy when you weren't actually pregnant. And this does get pretty confusing for a lot of people. So conception happens at the time you ovulate, when sperm and egg meet up, and ovulation usually happens about mid-cycle or about two weeks after your period started. You won't find out you're pregnant until the time of your missed period or two weeks after conception, but at that point you're considered to be four weeks along. It's been four weeks since your last period, but the baby has actually only been growing for two weeks, so that's where it kind of gets confusing. So the first week of the 40-week gestational period is actually the, the first week when you were having your period. Um, in the cycle that you actually got pregnant in. So that's all a little bit confusing, but just go with it. Since your doctor gave you an accurate due date based on an early ultrasound, then you can pretty much say, yep, I'm due on October 21st. I sincerely hope the best for you during your pregnancy. And if you have more questions for me in the future, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash intermountain moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.